This is a place where there's a lot of opportunity. We provide the most nephrology care for the state of Maine. It is a growing institution. You know, we are privileged to have a very diverse population. Being in a rural state, it's really the only game in town for more advanced care. The sense of community here, more than just a medical center providing medical care. The medical center is a very welcoming environment for people from, you know, all walks of life. The fellowship program here is very well balanced, is ever-changing in terms of the, in, the environment of medical breakthroughs and technology. They get a wide experience across many subspecialties of nephrology that gives them enough confidence to go out into private practice after they leave here. Our program is small enough and unique enough and hands-on enough that we really get to know our fellows over time. The fellows are very much, very much involved. You have more close contact with the attendings and they have more time for you because there are fewer fellows that they need to divvy up their time, and I think it shows. That's something that sets this institution apart, and you get to know the nuances of care delivery that maybe you don't pick up quite as well other places when you don't spend quite as much time with each individual faculty member. My goal is that our fellows are going to graduate and be able to meaningfully participate in the pre, peri, and post care of transplant patients, both short-term and long-term. I think our transplant programs is one of the things a lot of fellows uh, leave here feeling really comfortable about. We get the transplant dedicated almost for like a month and a half up front in the first uh, couple months of fellowship. And I would say by the end of your fellowship, you should be very comfortable managing a complex, large dialysis unit. We do our own ultrasounds, we do our own endovascular procedures. We're also providing telehealth visits to, to primary care docs or hospitalists at other hospitals about how to treat medical conditions. Our fellows are going through simulated cases about end-of-life discussions, about dialysis uh, modality choices. We have a number of patients who have nowhere else to get their care. We provide dialysis care for that population and it's a really ideal opportunity to get a taste of what it's like to take care of people who otherwise cannot access health care easily. So there's a huge array of services that fellows can readily tap into. It's much more collegial and I it's a different experience that I wasn't necessarily expecting. So my initial thoughts of Maine was going to be cold and dark. <laughs> well, I've been here 20 years. It's great. This is just an ideal place to raise a family, to have outdoor pursuits and activities. Being from the Caribbean, most of my friends thought it was where to move to the Northeast. Within six months of being here, I realized that is actually just the opposite. And we actually honeymooned here and came through Portland and kind of smitten with it and really wanted to come here, hopefully to stay. I find that people generally care about one another. They care about the provision of care for their patients, and it really shows. What's really beautiful about being able to train in an environment like this is that you have a staff, a faculty that have trained in a variety of excellent institutions who are interested in delivering both excellent clinical care, but also really providing an academic environment that nurtures the people that are learning to be the next generation of physicians.